Hi everybody, I'm Dawn. Welcome to my vlog. I'm sorry about the darkness. I haven't opened any blinds or turned any lights on yet. Um, just getting ready to start my day. I don't have a lot going on today. Um, yeah, not really. Not a, not a whole lot. Um, but maybe this weekend we'll do something exciting. We're just getting some steps in, in the maze. I've taken you on here before. I wish it was like really high, like in The Shining. But I can imagine for little kids, this is really fun. I mean, I think it's fun and I'm a big kid. Oh no, they got me. Trickery. Look at him. Oh, he flew away. Scared him. They've got these guys painted all over town. So here's me and him. Hey, honey. admit it is a little little chilly for me today look at that big fish that's the biggest fish i've seen in this pond where's he where are you going oh spider webs there's a turtle Kind of a big one. Not a lot, of, a lot of critters out today. Look at this guy. Oh, you're blurry. Focus. There we go. Oh. Hi, guy. Oh, here comes another one. I don't have any food. I don't have any food for you. Maybe I'll bring some. Look at that neck. Where'd you go? <laughs> oh my God. I see a new type of critter. He's going under here, so I have to see. I have to see what he is. I think it's a big otter. Waiting for him. Oh my God, there he is. <laughs> hey. <gasps> Look at him. Can you see him? Oh my gosh, look at that guy. Hi, Otter. Oh my God. I've never seen one this up close before. Oh. Are you coming this way? You're probably going up in there to get comfortable, aren't you? Let's give him a minute. Oh, look, there he is. Oh, my God. Hi, beauty. Hey. Oh, no, that's not an otter. That's a one of those invasive things. What are they called? He's still cute. Nutrias.
He's cute though. I know he's a critter, but Hey. Sorry, this is so long, but I want to see if he gets out of the water. Critter, get out of the water. Oh, sorry. So basically they're like giant rats. <laughs> Still cute though, I think. Okay, I've got a monitor to shop for. I can't be here all day. Look at that big ugly tail. Eek. Scratch your itches. We call those things river rats. I can't not watch. Oh, there he goes. He's going to go in there now. All right, we'll be done. Okay, so I got me a big cup of ice. Does this count as takeout? Because I needed the ice, but I don't have the freezer room for a huge bag. And then I got me a Zephyr Hills. I reuse my water bottles for many projects. So... Don't come after me. Because I figured out. What I like is the iciness. It's not the frozen Coke. It's not the Coke part. 
it's the iciness. So get me some nice crushed up ice, fill the cup with the ice, and then drink water. That's good. Because okay. I need to cut the frozen Coke out. And I'm doing that right now. I had my last frozen Coke. And I shan't be having any more. We'll see how that works out. I'm pretty weak when it comes to frozen Coke. That's really good. That tastes good. Feels good in my throat. So I just went into Whole Foods. They did not have what I was looking for. Um, but they were giving out samples of gooseberries like in the produce department. I never had a gooseberry before, so I thought, well, let me try it. Oh my God. It, it tastes, they said it tastes like pineapple. Did not taste like pineapple to me. It tasted like uh, grapefruit, only more acidic. Um, I mean, it wasn't terrible. I could see how someone might like it, but it's not my thing. Definitely not something I would, eh, you know what? It would probably be they would probably be good tossed in a in like a green salad, like a savory salad. So, by themselves I didn't like them, but now that I think about it with like some spinach or something, it would probably be delicious. Maybe I'll try that one day and, and see how I like it that way. I want to talk about Life by Jen for a second. You know, Jen, is it Jennifer Gwen Ann or something like that? Well, y'all y'all know Life by Jen. If you don't that's fine too. She's one of the girls. She's up there with, you know, Amberlynn, Foodie Beauty, you know. Uh, now, I don't watch really, other than Amberlynn, I don't really watch the, the other ones. Unless y'all think I should. Give me some recommendations. I watch Amberlynn because I actually like her. I like her. Um, I mean, sometimes I find her content kind of boring and directionless but you know some people might say that about my content but I just I still like her I, I, I like her her channel sorry um, but and I notice a lot of people like are more supportive of Jen and they seem to like her because she seems really sweet you know she's got this sweet little voice and everything but I'm not buying it with her. She makes me more crazy than Amber Lynn does. I, I think this woman is full of shit. And not that this should matter, but I mean, like people want to see weight loss failure. Want to talk about weight loss failure. I know Amber Lynn is a hot mess with that. But in the three years I've known about Jen, she's gained way more in that period of time than Amber Lynn has gained in eight years. She's, and then she's so hateful and nasty to her viewers. And I, these are the people that are helping you out. And then her ridiculous wish list and complaining about her free medical care. You know, I just, I have a lot of problems with her, but I'm gonna do a standalone video about her. And, you know, to hell with it if people take offense or are pissed off at me for it. Because I just, you know, people like talk about Amber Lynn and trash on Amber Lynn and everything. But, Jen, this motherfucker, I mean, she is, I mean, Am I know Amber Lynn, people see Amber Lynn as a hot ma mess. But Jen is, you know, and they t like to talk about how Amber Lynn is close to death. And then definitely Amber Lynn is not, you know... In, in a healthy spot, but Jen, she's bed bound and she, she's just getting worse. And she's, it just seems like the more weight she gains, the more entitled she becomes. And it, she's just, it's disgusting to me. And I don't think she's sweet. You know, I know people like her because she had that sweet little voice, but I don't think she's sweet. I think she, she's a manipulative, 
sneaky, shifty person. And, um, no. My apples are done, so I used, I, I, I was sugar in these apples for a video I'm going to be doing um, that uses preserved apples. I don't have preserved apples, so we're making do. I'm going to do an early American, the early American channel. I'm going to do a cooking video um, referencing a recipe used, or well, the cooking video they did. <laughs> but I think that's the, that for this vlog. And um, thank you so much for watching. And I'll talk to everyone later. Bye.